So, hallo zurück. Hier geht es gleich weiter mit unserem aufregenden Gespräch mit der Malia Gerde, der aufregenden Frau aus Gabriels Träumen. Und wir wollen sie gerade ein bisschen uns dazu befragen, äh, über sie selbst befragen. Und deswegen fragen wir einfach mal, woran sie so interessiert ist. What kind of things interest you? I don't have a lot of free time, but I do appreciate the arts. Opera, symphony, ballet, fine art. If you look around, you'll see that we collect African art, for example. Yes, it's very beautiful. It is, Detective. It means a great deal to me. Ah ja. Nichts über Voodoo-Wissen, aber afrikanische Kunstwerke sammeln. Na gut. Ja, aber haben Sie hier was? Eine Karriere gemacht? Do you have a career? A career? Being the head of the Getty family is a 24-hour-a-day job. We have many holdings and many responsibilities, financial and otherwise. The management of our business affairs and properties leaves me with time for little else. Poor little rich girl? Believe it or not, Detective, wealth does have its price. John. So ist das wohl. Tell me about your family. The Gettys? We're a very private family. How many people are there in your family? Well, my mother just passed away. Oh. I am sorry. So am I. She was a magnificent woman. We were very close. I was an only child. And your father? I never knew him. It's hard to believe that any man would leave a woman like you. Or like your mother must have been. He did not leave, Detective. But that's really none of your concern. I'm sorry. Go on. There are, of course, other Gettys in the city. I have a large, extended family. I see. Na. Einzelkind ist sie gewesen und ihre Mutter ist gerade verstorben. Damit, und der Vater ist weg, damit ist sie jetzt also quasi alleine und muss sich mit dieser neuen Situation erst zurechtfinden. Ja, ah, das war jetzt mal so eine kurze Zusammenfassung. Ah, weiter im Text. Die wichtigste aller Fragen natürlich für Gabriel. Do you have a husband? A boyfriend? I'm very independent, Detective. The women in my family have always preferred it that way. So, you've never been married? No, and I never will be. What about children? Yes, that is likely. Someday. Ich würde gern alles wissen. I'd like to hear just about anything. I do a lot of charity work around the city, primarily in the prison and reform system. I'm not a professional sociologist, but it does interest me. Ja. Und sonst? I'd like to hear just about anything. I have a business degree from Vanderbilt. I wanted to study psychology, but my family's interests came first. Oh? Why not something like law, then? Surely that would have been an asset to the family. Law? Please, I do have some morals, Detective. <laughs> Ach so. Yo. I'd like to hear just about anything. For the record, I'm 28, Detective. For the record, natürlich. 28? 28. Ja gut, kann passen. I'd like to hear just about anything. I have a few friends. A woman in my position can't really afford them. Jo, schieb doch weiterhin alles auf deine Position. I'd like to hear just about anything. I try to stay away from the media as much as possible. Last year there was that story about John Kennedy Jr. and I. The phone didn't stop ringing for weeks. I prefer to keep my private life private. I would appreciate it if you would keep my name away from any public association with the police, Detective. Of course. Of course, ja. Ja, so spannend kann dein private life ja nun nicht sein. 24 Stunden lang Family Business der Gaddis übernimmst. 
I'd Aber like to hear just about anything. Wir wollen ja alles wissen. I do a lot of charity work around the city. Primarily in the prison. Ach so, ja, gut, alles klar. Na gut, äh... Uh, I wouldn't know where to begin. As you wish, Detective. Damit kam Mowell zurück. Ähm, ja, dann, ähm... Was war hier? Ach so, mit dem See, ja, da haben wir Can you tell me anything about what happened out of the lake? Ja, kennengelernt. I wish I could, but I've never seen or heard anything unusual at the lake. And I do spend quite a bit of time out there. Ja. Can you tell me anything? I wish I could, but I've never seen or heard anything unusual. Ja, okay, alles klar. Ja, dann, ne? Dann leg dich mal ins Zeug, Gabriel. Excuse me. But your eyes are really distracting. I don't think I've ever seen a color quite like that brownish gold. It's so deep and rich. Man, if I could bottle that, I'd make a fortune. Thank you, Detective. That's an interesting observation, though probably not relevant to your case. A good detective never knows what might be relevant, Miss Getty. Then you must be truly exceptional at your job. I think this has gone on long enough. You're not really a detective, are you? Who, me? Well, I am on this case, Miss Getty. I saw you at the lake yesterday. I thought you must be with the police since you were there, but you don't act like a police officer. Besides, I'm rather certain that the other man said his name was Mosley. All right, you caught me. I'm not with the police. My name is Gabriel Knight. I'm a writer working with Detective Mosley on a book. Well, Mr. Knight, now that we've established who you are, perhaps you can tell me the real reason you're here. Well, I am researching the book. And I thought you might have seen or heard something at the lake. I don't like liars, Mr. Knight. Okay, okay, you're right. I, I really just wanted to see you again. You can be mad at me if you want, but I swear... I've never done anything like this before. Mr. Knight, you've lied about your identity and wasted my time with meaningless questions. If it weren't vaguely flattering, I'd really be angry. You're lucky I don't call the real police. I think you should go, Mr. Knight. Malia, wait. If you oh. just give me a chance. I've wasted enough time. I'll have Robert show you out. Mitch Malia. Robert? Ja. Show Mr. Knight out, please. Please. Ja, das kommt auch schon alleine. Ja, oh, thank you very much. I had a lovely time. Ah, shit. <lacht> Ach, man. Ja, ist wohl scheiße gelaufen, war Gabriel? Naja, da kann er nur besser werden. Ja. Ne? Also die Dame war jetzt doch sehr kurz angebunden, sage ich mal. <lacht> so, was auch immer uns das jetzt geholfen hat. Wollen wir einfach nochmal versuchen, nochmal <lacht> noch reinzukommen. Miss Geddy is busy, Officer. And has instructed me to wish you good luck. That is all. If you'll just tell her goodbye, Sir. Menno, du, du, Miss Geddy is du busy, Butler, du, and has instructed me to wish you good luck. That is all. If you'll just tell her, goodbye, sir. Ja gut, an ihrem Wachhund da kommen wir wohl nicht vorbei. Komm, It wouldn't be worth breaking into Malia's. Ja, was anderes bleibt uns ja nicht übrig. It wouldn't be. Na gut, äh, dann sparen wir uns das hier. Ja, dann gehen wir jetzt erstmal hier, verschwinden wir hier erstmal. Ja, und ähm, was können wir denn dann als nächstes machen? Am Tatort, da dürfte wohl nicht viel Neues sein. Bei der Großmutti, da wüsste ich jetzt nicht, warum wir da jetzt hin müssen. Ja, Drugstore. In den Drugstore, ins Voodoo-Museum. Naja, wir können uns ja das nächste Mal überlegen, wo wir weitermachen. 
Deswegen, ja, überlege ich mir das bis dahin und sage erstmal Au revoir.